So Power of the Purse, yeah. 15th year. This is a premier luncheon, very beloved. And I love it because Callie and Caroline are here and y'all are co-chairs. This we year. are. We're That's so excited. Been. Yes, it's I been know. a really, really fun experience. I'm so glad. Yes. I, I think uh, we'll talk more about how people can get tickets and things. But tell me about this year's speaker and what what we're expecting. Um, this year we're going back to our healthcare roots with Dr. Ben Carson. We are so excited. I don't know if um, you can recall, but. He is, or he was the director of pediatric neurosurgery at Johns Hopkins. Oh, He's yeah. retired from medicine, but he continued to serve whenever he was the 17th secretary of the U.S. Department of Housing and Urban Development. Yes. And he's the founder and chairman of the American Cornerstone Institute. Okay. And now he comes to different groups like us and talks about leadership. So we're very excited to have him. Listen, it's pretty exciting. I remember Dr. Carson running for president. Yes. And then he became uh, urban development. Mm -hmm. I thought that was uh, really, he served so well mm -hmm. uh, and, and helped a lot of people. What, what are we, these beautiful purses and, and for people that are not familiar what do they have what is the power of the purse i mean there's some power in the purse absolutely yeah. we're bringing women together to celebrate women's health and the research that the texas the laura w bush <laughs> institute for women's health is doing through texas tech university health sciences center um, by doing that we are bringing together lots of women to our luncheon the power of the purse where we have a very iconic si silent auction style purse auction oh, okay. um, and these bags are donated to us from the community so we have lots of wonderful year after year donors and supporters that clean out their closets and oh. give us their give us their treasures so that they can find new life and share new hope and uh, raise money for a fabulous cause so yeah come to the luncheon we the doors open at 10 30 so that people can shop a little bit okay. early okay uh, and then you know we close that out towards the ends of the luncheon so um tables got to have a ticket got to have a table and some years the tickets go really fast some years we're talking early because this event is in April. What do the tickets and tables? I mean, does, does it, can we still? Um, this year we do still have a few tables, but they are going fast, so you better snatch them up quick. And okay. um, they can give a call to the Laura Bush Institute for Women's Health if they want more information or go to laurabushinstitute.org. Okay. And so they can find some more information. We do not have any tickets this year, but we do have a few more tables. Gotcha, I'm so glad that you said that because mm -hmm. uh, the, the table sponsorship you know, they seat, I'm thinking probably about eight. Yeah, yes. they so, yeah, yeah, somewhere around there. So we want people to be knowing. So all the money raised, I don't know if people really know what the money goes to. And, and I think we try to remind all the time, but I think that Amarillo is pretty dang lucky to have the Laura Bush Institute. I think not, not many places have this uh, institution and, and helping so many. Absolutely. We have devoted millions in groundbreaking research in women's health. So that can be everything across the TTU HSC campuses. That can be everything from breast cancer to rheumatology that oh. those research dollars are going towards. And then here locally, those are going to things like nursing scholarships um, for oh. local nursing students. Uh, the Infant Risk Center, where they are doing groundbreaking research that is some of the best in the world oh. on how medications impact pregnant and lactating mothers. Um, so really, as, as women, that's a really important issue for all of us as well. Um, also things like uh, going towards the Human Sex Trafficking Symposium that is held here locally for area health care providers. That's a really, really uh, interesting and important topic. That's really topic. grown. So, that, yes. that has grown and is big. It sure has. So these dollars are going to very, very impactful things that will make a difference to our quality of life and our health in our lifetimes. Tell, can you tell us a little bit about some of the purses we see today? Mm -hmm. Yes, so this is the exciting part. Okay. <laughs> yes. okay. Um, so one of our new things for this year, we have some ladies that got together to do a third party fundraising event oh. to buy some additional bags. So this one right here is one of the beautiful bags as well as that white Hermes over there. Oh my god. And we are so grateful <laughs> for them and so excited to show off. We have a few more and so excited Whoa. to show those off as well. And we've also got a good selection of some luxury and then some lower, like just good everyday bags as well. So we've got some fun little spring and summer collections that we're excited for. Well, I love the colors uh, yeah. in the light blue, the pink, mm -hmm. uh, the beautiful uh, creamy white mm -hmm. over there. I think that people, um, I think that men have caught on. Hey, 
a really nice bag is <laughs> what my wife or my fiance or girlfriend or I think I think that even you have people I've seen where they're on the phone bidding <laughs> for yes, yes. the bags to, because they know it's something that that ladies really enjoy and like and so I love that I think that people what a creative way and it's been going on 15 years mm -hmm. absolutely I think it's a, a really fun thing that you can think that you can come and freshen up your your purse wardrobe for the spring and be contributing to a great cause you yes. know um, you, it's it's one yeah. thing to buy it online or from a local retailer which are both you know great options but when you're buying from us you're uh, giving a, a, a handbag a second a second chance at a, a, at a new life and you're yeah. also giving uh, money towards a really fabulous cause so it's so people good. love it people yes, love it and we, we see many years to come for power of the purse. Yeah, we're so excited. just very quickly, tell me tell me some brands. We said a little here, but mm -hmm. you you said luxury. Just give us a little bit of brands that maybe mm -hmm. women will see. And um, we've got a great selection of Louis Vuittons this year. And so if you can see that beautiful one over there and Ooh. then this cute little one oh, right look, here. Look. And so we've got That's all shapes cute. and sizes. We've got a few Chanel's oh. and we've got a bunch of Kate Spade and Coach and just a bunch of Consuela, all kinds of different brands. Cool. So we're excited and we are working on an online gallery right now. Okay. So that'll be going live as it gets closer to the event so everyone can do a little pre-shopping. Okay. And where could they find that when that's ready? Um, we'll have it all on our social media okay. and then as people, as the table sponsors are getting all their information, we'll sure. be sure that it's communicated to them as well. Sure. And, and you I, can find this, all of that on the Institute's yeah. website as sure, well, which I'm sure, sure you guys are going to put up there yeah. for us. So. Yes, <laughs> yes. And I, we wanted folks to know social media is so important. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, we found, I mean, website's great, but I know y'all are working hard, even though, I mean, it's early. This again, this event uh, in April. So uh, we have time. So we'll look forward to that. Absolutely. We hope to see you all there. Thank you, ladies, We're for excited. coming. Thanks Thank for having uh, us. And I think, I think you make a terrific team. And I'm glad that you're co-chairing. <laughs> Uh, together because I think I think having good friends good people together and uh, having strengths in one area I mean it just makes it great so I hope you do more things together yes I know it's been I a fun process yes that we've had a fun. really good time and that's important when you're volunteering in the community it you is. need to love what you do I love that you said that well thank you ladies for coming